Welcome to lesson number five of the seven steps to a mobile friendly website e-course. When creating content for your mobile site, it's always important to remember that less is more. In other words, you should only display the pertinent information while cutting down on additional content and features that could essentially slow mobile devices down. Most mobile visitors are looking to make some form of contact with your business, but they don't want to have to dig around to find details, such as your phone number, email address, hours of operation, and physical address. Make sure your contact information is clearly visible on your home page, in prominent view. This eliminates the need of additional scrolling and searching, which can quickly become exasperating for today's business mobile users. Some mobile users will be seeking information about your products and or services before making the decision to do business with you. Therefore, it is important to have a page on your mobile site that briefly gives some details about what you have to offer. All consumers love a great deal, so placing a coupon on your mobile site is one way to get more visitors to take action. In fact, mobile coupons are redeemed 10 times more than traditional coupons. So, if coupons fit your type of business, be sure to use them. Many mobile users are also social media users. In fact, social media is one of the top ranked activities for mobile users. So, be sure to add all of your social media icons and sharing buttons to your mobile website, such as Facebook, Twitter, and YouTube. This will help grow your social following. Photos are a great way to showcase your products and services, so you may want to include a few on your mobile website. However, do not add too many as this could bog down your site, causing it to load slowly. Videos and heavy graphics can also slow down your mobile website, so keep them at a minimum for the best results. Remember, the room on a mobile website is extremely limited, so only include information that mobile visitors will find helpful. Eliminate any fluff because your visitors are not usually interested in how your business got started or the type of awards and achievements you have. So you can leave that for your main website. In the next lesson, we will discuss some of the common mistakes that many businesses make with their mobile websites.